Hey there, welcome back to our channel Mechanical Boost. Today, we are diving into a topic that every car enthusiast should be aware of, the symptoms of a bad boost pressure sensor. Before we jump into the symptoms, let's quickly discuss what a boost pressure sensor actually is. A boost pressure sensor monitors the boost pressure within the intake manifold. The engine control module uses this data to gauge the proper amount of fuel, determine optimal ignition timing, and operate the turbocharger wastegate. Essentially, it ensures that the engine receives the correct amount of air and fuel for efficient combustion. The boost pressure sensor is usually located in the intake pipe, in front of the throttle valve. It can also be found between the outlet of the turbo and the throttle body, down by the intercooler, or easily accessible from the top. Now, let's talk about the common signs that your boost pressure sensor might be failing. 1. Loss of power. One of the most common symptoms is a noticeable loss of power. If your car feels sluggish or struggles to accelerate, it could be due to a malfunctioning boost pressure sensor. 2. Poor fuel economy. Incorrect readings from the boost pressure sensor can cause the engine to run either too rich or too lean. Running rich leads to excessive fuel consumption, while running lean can result in incomplete combustion and decrease fuel efficiency. Both scenarios can contribute to poor fuel economy. 3. Surging or stalling Inaccurate readings from the boost pressure sensor can cause irregularities in the air-fuel mixture, leading to engine surges or hesitations during acceleration. If the sensor provides drastically wrong information, it can even cause the engine to stall, especially during sudden throttle changes or load variations. 4. Check engine light. When the engine control module of your car detects a problem with the boost pressure sensor, such as inconsistent readings or a complete failure, it triggers the check engine light to alert the driver. Your vehicle's computer may also trigger a trouble code. Common trouble codes associated with a bad boost pressure sensor include P0235, P0236, P0237, and P0238. 5. Rough idle. An unstable idle speed can occur when the engine control unit receives incorrect data from the boost pressure sensor. The engine control unit relies on this sensor to maintain a stable idle by adjusting the air-fuel mixture and ignition timing. If the sensor provides inaccurate readings, the ECU may struggle to keep the engine running smoothly at idle. 6. Engine knocking Incorrect air-fuel mixture caused by a faulty boost pressure sensor can lead to abnormal combustion, resulting in engine knocking or pinging. Running too lean can cause detonation, while running too rich can lead to pre-ignition, both of which can cause knocking sounds. 7. Excessive Exhaust Smoke A faulty boost pressure sensor may cause the engine to run rich, meaning there is an excess of unburned fuel in the combustion chambers. This unburned fuel passes through the exhaust system, leading to black smoke emissions. 8. Engine Misfires Incorrect readings from the boost pressure sensor can result in improper fuel and air mixture, leading to engine misfires. Misfires occur when the air-fuel mixture fails to ignite, or ignites at the wrong time. If you're experiencing any of these symptoms, it's essential to address the issue promptly. Ignoring a faulty boost pressure sensor can lead to further engine damage and costly repairs down the line. Depending on the severity of the issue, you may need to replace the boost pressure sensor. Thankfully, this is a relatively straightforward repair that can be done by a qualified technician. If you found this video helpful, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more automotive tips and tricks. As always, thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.